hello everyone in this video we will see how to use mutable data member and what, what are the usage of mutable data member so let's first of all include header file and then we will specify namespace and we will create a simple class class 1 in this class let's declare two variables these two data member will be a uh, private data member of this class and let's Define a constructor. This constructor will assign a equal to 10 and let's say b equal to 10. And uh, then here we are taking one function uh, show. And this function we made as constant. So constant function can access value of a data mem a member, but it cannot change. So let's say we are printing value of A and B. And then we will define our main function. Let's create object of class 1. And call show. We will compile our program. Compiled and so it's uh, printing 10 10 so now uh, there is no issue now let's say we want to change some value of a and we want to make it 40 so when we try to uh, compile our program it will say one error why this error is coming because this function we have made this function constant and constant function can only access they cannot change this value but if uh, <laughs> We want to change a value of some variable in constant function. We have to make those number as mutable. So now if we compile our program, there won't be any other. So mutable actually used for constant function. Constant function by default they cannot change value of any variable. But there is an exception with mutable data member. Mutable data member value can be changed in constant function. Thank you very much for watching.